This video will cover the topic, Change of Base for Logarithms, Problem Type 1. In this video, we will discuss how to compute logarithms with bases other than 10 or E. Let's start by stating the change of base formula. The log base A of B equals the log base C of B divided by the log base C of A. Both C and A must be positive real numbers, such that A and C are both not equal to 1. What does C represent in that equation? Good question. Since C will be the ending base of the logarithm, we should choose a base readily available on a calculator, such as base 10 or E. That way, we can input the logarithms into the Alex graphing calculator to compute the logarithm. Okay, this is starting to make some sense, but can we do a quick example problem just to be sure? Sure. Let's look at the example problem, log base 5 of 1 ninth, being sure to round your answer to the nearest thousandth. We can start by substituting the given logarithm into the change of base formula to result in log base 10 of 1 ninth divided by log base 10 of 5. Solving this equation by inputting the logarithms into the Alex graphing calculator will result in an answer of negative 1.3652, etc. But remember we need to round to the nearest thousandth, resulting in an answer of negative 1.365. Okay, I think I'm starting to understand this topic, but can we do a second example problem? Sure. Let's look at another example. Log base one-sixth of eight, and we are again rounding to the nearest thousandth. Start by converting the logarithm into the change of base formula to result in log base 10 of eight divided by log base 10 of one-sixth. Solving this equation using the Alex graphing calculator yields negative 1.161 when rounding to the nearest thousandth. Okay, I think I understand this topic now, but let me quickly summarize just to be sure. We begin by rewriting the logarithm according to the change of base equation using base 10 for the logarithm. Next we input the equation into the Alex graphing calculator and round our answer to the nearest thousandth. That's right. 